What is up, you guys? It is your boy John here from Puma Plot. Welcome back to another Felsburn video here on the PC. I do appreciate you guys clicking on the video. How's it going? And welcome, you guys. I told you I was just gonna take a little break. Boom, be right back in. That's exactly what we're doing. I paused the game even. Did you guys know you can pause the game and nothing happens? You can do it in multiplayer. It's a great troll, by the way. Just throwing that out there. Um, don't do it in my server. Not happy about it, but you know, it's a great troll nonetheless, <laughs> and it does happen in my server quite a bit. Anyway, uh, speaking of my server, twitch.tv slash pumaplow, come give me a follow on Twitch, I would appreciate it. Stream farm sim over there, it's a good time. Make sure you guys tune in. Uh, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday, uh, play farm sim right now on Saturdays and usually one other day, or two. <laughs> usually two, <laughs> let's be real. Uh, ever since we started, um, God, what's the name of that map? Fenton Forest by Stevie. Ever since we started Fenton Forest, it's like, that's all I want to do is play that map. <laughs> but I don't want to start a Let's Play in it because it is basically a Felsborn edit. Um, it is, it is, it's just a Fels, his Felsborn edit, which is a great edit, don't get me wrong. Um, but I want to wait for like an original map before I start a, uh. Uh, another let's play you know that's what I would like to do and I know there's a lot of people that probably want it on Xbox but I don't think I'm gonna do that <laughs> don't think I'm gonna do that so I'm a little spoiled and I'm gonna admit it here I'm spoiled by my gaming computer I really am because Farmson runs so much better on on here than it ever could on Xbox <laughs> just saying I know there's a bunch of you guys that play Xbox and and all that good stuff, but I kind of like just having the one series right now, three days a week. Um, I do enjoy that. I'm not going to lie. Um, maybe when a 4X map comes out, and I know I've talked about it in the past and, and pretty much confirmed or committed to it. Um, a high-speed series again. I really enjoy the high-speed high speed series. Uh, what you guys don't realize about that high-speed series is that's the perfect time for me because I record for... An hour to an hour and 20 minutes usually is what I used to do. So we'll probably record for around an hour and a half this go around. Since I'm trying to make my videos 30 minutes instead of 20 minutes. Um, like I used to. But uh, uh, it's a perfect opportunity for me to catch up on YouTube. And you know watch some TV shows <laughs> like while I'm recording. I have stuff to listen to basically. Listen Linda. Uh, so basically, it's a, it's a great opportunity for me to uh, kind of take in some media, catch up on some stuff, you know, that kind of stuff. And I kind of miss having that time <laughs> where it's like, okay, I need something to watch while I'm playing, right? Because like right now, I I don't have anything else pulled up. A, you guys would hear it um, because what I used to do is I'd pull it up on my tablet and just watch stuff on my tablet on the keyboard stand here, you know, as I was farming along. It's It's a good time. But uh, <laughs> you guys would obviously hear it. Plus, I'd probably focus on that more than... No, I probably wouldn't. I enjoy Farm Sim quite a bit. In case you guys can't tell, it's like the best game ever <laughs> to me. <laughs> oh, goodness. Goodness, goodness, goodness. Anyway, so this will probably be the last of the batch of recordings here. Uh, I know it's not necessarily the best way to go at making videos to get kind of far ahead and stuff, but... I was in a good place. I was like two weeks ahead, and then mom got sick and went back in the hospital, as everybody knows, um, when she did, you know, several weeks ago now at this point. And uh, all video production just came to a screeching halt. There was none. There was no video production. So uh, I got very far behind again, of course. And uh, so I, I need to stay some, some time ahead so I can continue to produce. I know I didn't post anything for like the first week, but I didn't make anything for over two weeks. So it kind of, you know, kind of, kind of got in a little bit of trouble there because I, I got really far behind. Like, you know, I shouldn't be, uh, rendering a video out the night before or rendering a video and uploading it the night before it comes out on YouTube. I shouldn't be doing that. You know, I really should not be doing that. So <laughs> It's just not a good practice to, to stay in, you know? Not good for longevity. So, there's that. There is that. But I do see all the comments, guys. I may not always reply. I don't reply via text, because 
I know there's not like a ton of comments, but it, it gets overwhelming really fast for me. Replying to comments via text, I like to reply to them in videos. So it might be a while, but I do like to reply to, or I like to, I see them all is what I'm trying to say. I do see every single comment. Uh, honestly, if you guys really have something pressing you need to uh, tell to me or whatever, there's there's uh, TeamSpeak. I'm in TeamSpeak quite a bit. There's Discord. You guys could always message me in Discord. Um, you can leave a comment on any video. I do see them all, like I said. Or uh, 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 Twitch, twitch.tv slash boomplop. Uh, links for everything, by the way, description down below. Just throwing that out there. Instagram, everything. <laughs> so... Go give all those things a follow. Join the Discord community. Uh, we have some fun in there, I'm not going to lie. And we keep talking about Minecraft. That's going to be a big part in the Discord community. Because the Minecraft server... server hopefully it's out by now, but I don't know. Uh, is going to be subscriber only, at least at first. We're going to see how it goes. If we decide it's not working, we'll pull the old Audible. And uh, we'll open it up to more people. It's not going to be... Just, hey, here's the thing, and there's no whitelist. No, it's still going to be a whitelisted server no matter what. And uh, it's not going to be open to everybody. We'll have some kind of criteria that people have to meet. Maybe it's an hours in chat type thing or something like that, because we just don't want randos in that troll, you know? That's really... The only reason we're kind of kind of picky about who I let in my server, any server, farms in Minecraft, whatever, is I just don't like being trolled. I really don't like being trolled. You think we can get the rest of these potatoes in this trailer? Ooh, that's going to be close. I'm going to say no, but we'll let it ride for now. Um, we need this guy. <laughs> it's like, I don't know which one we need, but we need one of them. Need to get our fertilizer filled up, too. Uh, we'll do that in due time, because we can get our fertilizer going over there. So, in due time, we got to do some herbicide first i don't really show too much of this uh to be honest because it's kind of boring in a way but it's not at the same time i know i can turn weeds off but i don't know it adds a level of uh, realism uh to the game for me so i like to leave it on <laughs> just like and i do like i like the realism you know i mean realism would be like this <laughs> but let's be honest this is better <laughs> for everybody involved right so, there's that. <laughs> there is that. Of course, in real life, I would want to wait for my weeds to come up to spray them, of course. But, hey, it's farm sim, and I can cheat the system, so why not? <laughs> That's the way I look at it, right? <laughs> Just saying. Yeah, okay. <laughs> that is definitely the way that I look at it. Oh, goodness me. Goodness me, we still need to work on this. We need money, guys. We need money. Hence why I'm, you know, buying fields and harvesting them and then reselling them. It's trying to make money. Because <laughs> if nothing else, you get your initial investment back every time, you know? So you're going to get that. You're going to make money off crop. It may not be a ton of money, but you're going to make money off the crop. Uh, the other thing is if I would do the fertilizing missions like I really need to and like I've been saying I'm going to, that would help quite a bit. I still want to film a high-speed fertilizing montage of like doing all the different fields. I don't know if that would be boring. But it's been a while since we've done a high-speed video, so... I feel like it could be uh, be a thing. Ooh. Wait for it to finish unfolding, huh? Probably just should have backed up. would have been so much easier and cleaner. And But, you know, that's okay, right? <laughs> That's okay. The problem with this sprayer, which, you know, if I'm going to try to do a fertilizing montage, I'm going to hope, 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 hope that I get a mission with an Arubicon. Now, there's only like two on this game you get an Arubicon for. 12 and maybe 10, maybe 13, but definitely 12. So you don't get an Arubicon much on this map. So it's kind of unfortunate, honestly, but... That would be the way to do a <laughs> high-speed fertilizing montage is with the uh, Rubicon, the giant self-propelled sprayer. That would be fantastic. <laughs> I'm just throwing that out there. Doing it this way, I'd probably use the pelt spreader, honestly, because uh, to me the pelt spreader's faster. I know it doesn't cover as much ground, but your ground speed at least seems like it's so much faster. I'd actually have to figure it out kind of. 
The pellet spreader lasts forever, too. This one definitely does not last as long. So from just the, uh, the aspect of how long it lasts, I would probably use the pellet spreader. I mean, the Rubicon's where it's at, but if I don't have the Rubicon, then pellet spreader is next best. Uh, speaking of, like, things in farm sim here, I cannot believe that they did not put in any kind of tank to transport liquid fertilizer in. You know, it, like a nurse tank. How nice would it be to have a nurse tank on a trailer? You know, don't make it massive. Don't make it a million liters. Just how nice would it be to have a nurse tank? I think it'd be awesome. I don't know why they don't have it. I'm sure I could find one in the mod land uh, very soon, if not already. I know I can find, like, placeable plate, you know, a placeable thing to buy seed fertilizer, that kind of stuff, too. But just have a nurse tank that I could tow from the shop to my field. You know, like, I think that'd be very nice to have. So, if you guys have any, there's a, uh, there is a mod channel in Discord. I think it's called John's Mods or something like that. John's New Mods, something like that. It's just a place for you guys to go and post links to mods that maybe you want to see in this map or on live streams, uh, something like that. Go in there, post a link up to a mod. It can be from the Mod Hub, it can be from the mod websites, whatever. And uh, I'll check them out. I do check that channel occasionally and look at the mods. I haven't actually downloaded any from there as of recording this, but uh, I need to get back in the mod world too. I do. I really need to make, uh, need to get back into making mod videos, you know? Those are always uh, really good videos for me, so need to get back into that, but for now, we're going to um, empty the potato harvester again. You know, sorry. It's going to be close on uh, filling up the stepper. I'm going to be annoyed if there's like a few left. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to be very, very annoyed. If I had to drive all the way up here just to get a few and then drive all the way back down there. Might annoy me a lot. <laughs> or a little. I'd probably just use the other tipper. I'd just use my John Deere that's over there. It's faster. It has more horsepower to pull hills and stuff, so... This isn't a bad little tractor. It's just, I don't think I'd put it on this big of a tipper, you know? Because, I mean, I mean it, it pulls the hill, don't get me wrong, but not uh, as fast as I would want it to, you know? But it does do it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to actually keep up with him going six, you know? That kind of thing. <laughs> like, come on. There we go, six, seven. Okay, we're, we got this. We've got this. There we go. Please don't fill me up. Please. Please don't fill me up. Fill me up. Buttercup, baby. I don't know the words. I need you. <laughs> to tell me the words to the song. A song. Because I forgot them a long time ago. Oh, man. Alright, so I wanted to do cleanup anyway, right? So, we'll get to that in just a second. Oh, our combine's done over here. Or he thinks he's done. He thinks he's done, but he's not. So, let's park this over here. Yeah, actually, it doesn't really matter because we got to drive the combine back anyway. So, let's go, John Deere. Let's go, John Deere. Uh, 9377, that's where we're at. Let's see. 9377. It's not going to be worth that much, but you know what? Every uh every little liter counts, right guys? Every little liter counts, boys. Every single one. <laughs> it's not even going to be 100, is it? Maybe. Uh if we get to 9477, it'll be over 100. It might not be even 100 liters. <laughs> it might be. It might be. <laughs> it's funny though. So, was it really worth me turning around and spending this time to, you know, do this? Is it going to be 100 liters? 7.7 seven is what we're looking for. To be 100. Okay, 101, 102, 103, 104. 104. Not bad. Totally worth it, right? <laughs> totally not at all worth it. Alright, good. Good talk. 
Good to oh my god, Jed. No, no, there's a, there's a tractor there coming. I was looking over at the other, um, the harvester over there, the potato harvester. This is what I was looking at. So we'll leave that for now, actually. And soybeans, that is soybeans, right? Yeah, soybeans. Best price is 50, no, 90, okay. That's our best price. So we're going to sell them. We're going to sell it. Um, we're going to sell it. Okay. So I know it's not that much, but it's going to be a few dollars. And if you think about it outside of paying for a little bit of maintenance and diesel, it's free. <laughs> it's free. So it would really be worth it, like I've been saying, if we did the fertilizing missions, because you get paid for doing twice. You know, you get paid for doing that, and then you buy the field and you take the steal the crop and then sell the field back. <laughs> I don't know. Seems like a thing to do. I don't know. Seems like a thing to do. Okay, we'll just go three wide. No big deal. No big deal. Boogity, boogity, boogity. Let's go racing, boys. I'm kind of happy, but I don't care at the same time <laughs> that NASCAR's back. Like, I'll watch it. You know, I'll watch a little bit here and there. I won't, I won't go crazy for it. But I will, I will have it on. Like, if, if we get back to the farm and it's on a channel we can watch down there and flip it on, I don't care. It's entertaining. I mean, I'm not the watch NASCAR every week kind of guy, but I enjoy it from time to time. I do. I do enjoy it from time to time. Uh, for sure, for sure. So, yeah, as of recording this, uh, I'm actually recording this right before the Daytona 500. So I don't know who won the uh, the Super Bowl of NASCAR, the Daytona 500. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure. But I'll probably keep an eye on that one, for sure. Because, <laughs> you know, it's entertaining and stuff. Why not, right? Why not? All right. Soybeans going down the road. And this is pure profit, basically, off of that field. I mean, I know we had to pay for running costs and diesel, but whatever. Let's uh, clear our marker. Clear our marker. Almost $2,300. Um, yeah, not bad. $54,000. $54,000. And watch this. Boom. Boom goes the dynamite. You ready for this? Boom. Sold the field back. Got our $403,000 back. And ba 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 boom, we're five thousand dollars short. Dang it! <laughs> I really thought we had it now. Five thousand dollars short. That's not bad though. We were a hundred thousand dollars short before, and we've sold none of our own our own grain. We've done missions, and we've you know robbed two fields of grain, but we've done we've sold none of our own grain. Okay. I know it's technically our grain because we bought the field, but you know what I mean. Like, stuff that we've planted. We've not sold any of that. I still have all that barley. And I believe, don't I have wheat too? I think I have wheat too. Probably going to sell the barley in this video, or at least start on it. <laughs> that would be nice. So we will le probably leave this tractor sitting up here because we don't need this anymore. For now, we got to finish up that other mission. We're finish up the mission. Let's let's work on that one right now. Actually, let's go. Let's go to it right. Meow. The harvester. Do a little bit of cleanup here. Not nothing too crazy. Nothing to do on this side. So that's good. This thing's wicked, though. I'm telling you. This thing is just wicked awesome, bro. Wicked awesome, bro. So I mean, I know this isn't gonna amount to hill beans either. We're at 375 right now, so I know this is not going to amount to anything, but it makes me feel better <laughs> if we do the cleanup work, okay? It makes me sleep at night, all right? Something like that. <laughs> Didn't I say 375 and we're at 38 or 48 or... Anyway, you know what I mean. It wasn't much. <laughs> it wasn't much at all. This thing's got to be really funky to drive. I'm just throwing that out there really a trip to drive with all those monitors holy cow that's awesome and then like those cameras there you can probably change those between multiple cameras too because you know why not need more cameras right 
probably do on something like this, though. Is the thing. You probably need to be able to see multiple points of this thing at the same time, so. I guess you put people on there, or you just, you know, set up cameras. <laughs> set up cameras, probably a lot better. Less chance of somebody falling off and getting hurt, right? Oh, okay, all right. So, those of you that are, like, hip and with it. Okay, because I'm not. But I have recently started the app TikTok. Now, I don't have an account on TikTok. And I'm probably never going to get an, an account. Because I'm not going to make any videos on TikTok. But, <laughs> there's some funny stuff on TikTok. <laughs> I'm just throwing that out there. <sighs> that app is amazing. I know it's, like, primarily younger people on there. Um, but there's, you know, there's a lot of older folks on there too. I say older, like, you know, my age, older, like thirties, you know, older, old. Um, I'm, I, I just, I don't know. I'm amused by what I, what I see on there for the most part. It's funny. It is some funny, funny stuff, guys. Just saying. I recommend the app. I like it. It's funny. It, it's, it's one of those, like, you, you get on the app, you start scrolling, you're like, oh my god, it's been three hours. <laughs> where did that time go? <laughs> Not really three hours, but you know. It's like, uh, where did that time go? I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. But it went some th somewhere really fast. That's for sure. Alright, so we, we actually, that was quite a bit. That was quite a bit. We just picked up like a thousand liters. It may not fit in my trailer. But it was, it was a, it's a fair bit. That is a fair bit. I like the way this thing... It's got a small hopper, though. That'd be my only, like, uh... Kind of complaint about it is the hopper is very small. Very, very small. Alright, let's lift it up. And turn it off. And jet across the field. Okay, the, the pipe... Oh, wow. Oh, wow, you could really get down inside of a trailer with this thing. See, that's what that's meant for. You actually would reach down inside the trailer so you don't hurt the potatoes. But you don't want to bruise them. I've actually seen trailers that have, like, special flaps inside of them as well. Actually, look, is that a camera up there? That's a light and a camera up there mounted on the end of that pipe. All right, so we have 432 left in the trailer. It's not worth coming back up here for that. It's not worth taking my John Deere and trailer from up here down there. It's not worth it. So we're just gonna let those let those go. We'll run this load, and we might have time to do a little bit of our selling. Need to finish up the herbicide, but I'll I'll take care of that off uh, off screen for you guys. I am going to. This is my last video I'm recording today. Like I said earlier, so I will hopefully have some time between the, uh, now and when I get to record again next week and do a whole harvest of those soybeans and then replant soybeans so that after we get that harvest done we can sell the world and hopefully buy a field or two with the money or a field at least we're gonna buy our other field here in a minute though we only need five grand so we should get that should probably keep some money for operating costs but we're gonna get a fair amount of money off this uh plus i want to sell barley anyway so We've got money sitting there. We just need to, you know, haul the, the product. That's all. So we will work on that uh, eventually here. In a couple of minutes, we will work on that. So, yeah, and stuff. Yeah, and stuff. <laughs> Close out this mission, though, and get this done. Never accepting another potato mission again. Don't worry, guys. I took the hint. Since I've been working on this for like four videos that today, or three videos or something, in a row now. We've been working on this same darn mission. <laughs> okay, don't put it in the river now. Don't pull a Benedict. Shots, I know. <laughs> Live stream. Twitch.tv slash Puma Plow. See the best moments there. I'm telling you, it's hilarious stuff that happens live, and it's just not the same watching it back on YouTube. It's just not the same. Go check it out live. Twitch.tv slash Puma Plow. Just saying, links in the description below. All right, all kinds of links down there, by the way. Go check them all out. I would appreciate it. All right, close out this mission. 
We should get paid for some of these as well. Maybe, hopefully. Or not. That works too. Um, okay, wow, we made uh, 4,300 from extra, basically. We did make a little bit earlier as well because I flubbed up where I was selling them. Um, oh, field 10 fertilizing. Oh, that's our field we want to buy. Can we get paid to fertilize the field that we want to buy? I mean, sorry, I got to turn my heat down over here. I'm roasting on my, on my, on my hip over here. Um, field 10 fertilize. Uh, challenge accepted, sir. <laughs> we just need to buy some fertilizer. That's all. All right, let's buy a few bags of fertilizer real quick. So we're going to... Oh, wait, how much money do we need for that field? Because um, I want to make sure I have enough. So we need 530. Oh, my God, I have $1,000 extra right now. All right, John, don't spend any money. <laughs> no, I'm going to sell that barley, too, though. So we'll have barley plus the mission money from this mission. We'll, we'll get that, too. So you know what? We do need to go ahead and, and fill this thing up because we need it in our homestead, too. So huh, that sucks. We have the money. We're spending the money. But we'll get back to the money. Buy lots of fertilizer. I like my fertilizer. I also like turtles. Do you guys know that? I don't really like turtle. I don't really care. For, I mean, I, I'm indifferent. I've never had one as a pet. Kinda, not really. My older brothers had a lot more pets than I ever did. They had rabbits. They had turtles. Uh, never really had a dog because mom's allergic to dogs. So no, none of us really. I did have a dog when I was like 12 to about 14. Uh, we got him from my mom's friend. And he was about 12 and I was 12. And we had him till I was about 14 and he was about 14. So he was an old pup. But uh, he was a good dog. He was a really good dog, actually. He was he was that dog that, like, hey, you want to go for a walk? And you just, like, don't worry about a leash. <laughs> and you just, of course, I wouldn't do that these days. You'd, you'd get arrested, probably. Uh, but back then, it was just like, I'm going to go walk him. I'm not going to tell you his name. I probably said it before on video, but uh not going to say it. <laughs> we didn't name him. But it was an interesting name. But like I said, we did not pick it. Um, but, um, yeah, he was a good dog. He was a really good dog. He was a, uh, he looked like Lassie, but he was smaller. So I uh, miniature border Collie or something, miniature Sheltie, something like that. But he looked just like Lassie looked like spot on like Lassie, but just fun size. <laughs> he's a good, he's a good dog. He's actually buried in my backyard. If anybody needs to know that, I don't think so. But he is. <laughs> so, oh, uh, there's that. There's that. He just, he got old. Like I said, he was about 14 when he had had enough. So, can't blame him. It was, he lived a good life. He lived uh, at my mom's friend's house. Uh, they had him from, from a pup, basically. And then we had him from like 12 to 14, something like that. So, they had him for like 12 years. So, he had a good long, good long life. That's for sure. All right. So, this will be our. We will be harvesting this crop. I'm not going to let this go to waste. Um, this field does need to be plowed. Um, we have our two little uh, subsoilers that we'll, we, will, we will plow with, and that's fine there. So let's go back to our 7R and go bonsai down the hill here a little bit. <laughs> the Geronimo! Do you guys know how much it's killing me to have $515,000 and know that we can't spend it? Until we get that fertilizing mission done, anyway. <laughs> then we can spend it. But until then, I gotta... Uh, I gotta keep it. <laughs> it's killing me. It's killing me on the inside, guys. Saving up money on farm sim is very difficult for me. Because I just want to spend, spend, spend. As soon as we have it, I want to spend it. Can we spend the money now, please? Is that a possibility? I'm not sure. So, tell you what, guys. I know this video is approaching its 30-minute mark. We're gonna... We're going to go into bonus time because I want to get this done 
and I don't want to make another video today. <laughs> so there's that. So we're going to hopefully get that done. We're going to buy that field so I can, uh, I might harm, you know what? I, that's what I will do. I'll commit to that. One second here. Let's work on this barley. 990. I'm going to take the 990 price. I'm going to, I'm going to take it. Plus it's right up the road here, Northwest. So I'm going to take that. I know that price might go higher, but we're going to take the 990 and just be happy. So what I'm going to commit to guys is, uh, because I'm going to be doing an off screen harvest anyway. Um, I will jump ahead greatly kind of. So I'm going to be doing an off screen harvest anyway of my fields. Uh, so what I will do is the first harvest on 10, I will plow it afterwards, you know, get it all herbicide, probably going to have to lime it to basically get that field all done for its first time, uh, either off video or should I, you know what, maybe I should make a high speed out of all that. Maybe that's what I'll do. Maybe I'll record that whole harvest that I was going to skip and make a high speed video out of the whole thing. Maybe like check in at parts, but do high speed, kind of like the logging adventure. That's what we're going to do. Boom, settled, done. So you guys will see us work or see me. I say us. There's no us. It's just me. It's me and you. So it's us. Uh, you guys will get to see me working on the new field, but in high speed form and I'll voice it over after and stuff. It'll be, it'll be a good time. So that's what we'll do. Uh, we are going to carry this video into bonus time though. Of course we are already in bonus time, uh, but we're going to carry this video until we get to purchase the field because it's killing me. And I want to show you guys because I, I like to, you know, buy things, sell things, you know, when you guys are a watching. So we got to at least get that fertilizing mission done, which I mean, it should be coming along. Yeah, he's almost half done already. So we won't take that long. We get that done. We have enough money now. Okay, we have enough money now. One load's going to get us. Yeah, forty four thousand five hundred eighty nine dollars. Not too bad. Then the next purchase, honestly, guys, is grain hauling slash storage. So we need to save up some money. We'll probably buy a truck after the field. Probably buy a truck in a small-ish, you know, good size. One of those, like, Kinsey's or whatever. Uh, auger wagons. It's probably what we'll go with. I don't need the big one. Plus, then I'd have to use the 7R. And the 7R is my planting tractor, basically, right now. So don't want to do that. 7R is going to subsoil, too. Actually, smaller tractors would be fine on those subsoilers. They don't take much. So I knew there was a reason I kept those things. I just wasn't sure why. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. It's for a while now. I'm like, I need to get rid of these things. But then I was like, no, I might use them someday. You never know. So I'm kind of glad that I've kept them, to be honest. But, yeah, we'll make we'll make the next harvest a high speed. That'll be good. That'll be good. I liked making the high speed videos. And I think you guys enjoy them from time to time as well. Just saying. Just saying. Now I have to remember to make it a high speed. I have to remember that. <laughs> Need my speech therapist to come and help me with my memory. Our other thing. She's kind of cute. <laughs> Is that bad? Is that bad to say? That's bad. I shouldn't say that. You never know who's watching. <laughs> She was, though. She was really cute. <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying. Anyway. <laughs> uh, you know, I learned my lesson back in the day. Mom was in, in like, the local hospital, but it was run by a different company kind of thing. And, uh, you know, it, it kind of made the rounds through there, like, what I did. Because people, you know... I was there so much. Everybody's like, what do you, what do you do for a job? Like you're always here. Like, you know, and I had to kind of explain, you know, what I did for a job and why I could take the time and, you know, be at the hospital every single day for like eight, 10, 12 hours, every single day, you know, person with a normal quote unquote normal job can't do that, you know, and you take that much time off and whatever. So the one day I, I talked to one of the therapists, I don't remember physical or occupational therapy. And, uh, I was walking down the hallway and the speech therapist kind of went, Hey, I hear you're, um, you're a Twitch streamer. And I was like, um, yes. And she goes, well, we were talking about you in the gym the other day. And I was like, okay, first off, that's weird. 
But, all right, cool, whatever. <laughs> so, apparently the therapist had a little little talk talk about your boy, which I thought was amusing. <laughs> and uh, the one, the speech therapist that worked at that hospital thing, uh, her boyfriend was like really her husband, boyfriend, I think boyfriend, was real fiance, maybe? I'm not sure now. Uh, he was really into like Twitch streams and stuff and wanted to be a streamer and watched a ton of Twitch apparently at the time and and whatever. And so I was like, yeah, this is my channel. You know, it's Poom Clock. I'm checking it out sometime. I'm streaming Saturday, blah, 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 blah. Well, I kind of made the mistake maybe of talking about a couple of the therapists on that stream. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> and I don't know if she heard me, but they all kind of looked at me different after that. <laughs> Because <laughs> I kind of had a thing for the one therapist there. I'm not going to lie. The uh, I'm not going to mention names. Don't worry. Um, I remember her name, though. First name, anyway. Don't know her last name. Uh, the occupational therapist there. She was, she was, she was, she was adorable. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I think I might have said something about her. And then they kind of never looked at me the same way. And I was like, oh, man. So I need to just keep my mouth shut because you never know who's listening, you know? That's kind of the creepy thing about this. You just never know. All right, so the Field 10 mission's done. Is there another mission for Field 10? Let's go ahead and confirm that one. And then just see for funsies. No, nothing else for Field 10. So Field 10 should be... Fertilized once and just growing. So what I can do is if I'm if I'm good, we're not just growing. This is just growing here, 17, 18, 19, 20. Uh, but if I'm good, I can wait for it to go another growth stage and then hit it again with fertilizer. Because I'm gonna I'm gonna buy it. But it needs to be plowed for sure. It needs to be plowed. So we will have to that's fine. We can subsoil that. So let's go ahead and buy that right now. We have the money. I like a lot. We have the money. Boom. Done. $530,000. Goodbye. <laughs> All right. Let's run our last load here, and then we are going to call this a video then. But, yeah, I need to watch what I say about people in real life. <laughs> it's kind of why, in a way, it's like I don't want to tell anybody what I do. Like, when I meet random people or, like, you know, mom's friends or dad's friends or something, it's like... I don't, even like family, like cousins and stuff, a lot of them don't know what I do. And I don't really want them, want them to either, you know? I don't really want them to know what I do. Uh, is that just like, oh, there's going to be one more load. Is that like a weird insecurity thing? Probably. But, you know, if I'm annoyed, you know, I like to think I have a pretty good just, yeah, I'll say it how it is, you know? So if. If I say something about a person, it's like, oh, I probably shouldn't have said that about XYZ person, you know? Or it's weird if I'm talking about, you know, XYZ person. So, I tend to just not tell a lot of people what I do. And then there's some people where it's like, oh, yeah, I make videos on YouTube. What's your channel? I'm not going to tell you. <laughs> like, uh, so... Um, I've suddenly forgotten what my own YouTube channel was because I don't really want you to watch. <laughs> I've had that happen. <laughs> I've had that happen. IRL. People I know. It's like, yeah, I'm just, I make online content. That's all you need to know. That's all you need to know. And then, of course, I have cousins, you know, and, and I haven't seen these cousins in years, but mom, mom and dad went to a birthday party Oh, back in, like, late fall. I was streaming that day, actually. So, it was, like, a scheduled stream day. It was a Saturday evening. And uh, it was a birthday party for my, um, for my uncle. I don't know. I don't see, okay, mom's family I definitely don't see anymore. When my grandma passed, like, major drama happened there. and We don't see, like, pretty much any of them anymore. I'd, occasionally we'll see my one uncle. Um, they've actually kind of started to mend fences with my mom because you know health issues with mom you might as well try to mend some fences there you know um but the other uncle we'll never see him again <laughs> we'll never see him again because he's an ass <laughs> he said he said god awful things about my mother after my grandma passed and 
yeah, we'll never mend fences with him. But the other uncle, I don't have a problem with. You know, he's he's okay. Um, but my dad's family, like my dad has an, a brother and a sister. I can't tell you the last time I saw my aunt, my my dad's sister, let alone her husband. Like I haven't seen them in forever. They live about forty five minutes away. I don't ever see them though. Never. So I was, you know, scheduled to stream, and I didn't know about the birthday party until like the day before. So can't really fault me for not going to that one. You know, when I don't know about something, I got to know in, in, in advance so I can schedule. Hey, guys, you know, I'm not going to be here for this stream XYZ. This is the reason why. I can't. I, I feel really guilty springing something on you guys like last minute, you know, unless it's like an emergency, you know, medical thing or something like that. And then whatever. I have to do what I have to do. But, uh, so my, he's my cousin, but he's like way older than I am. Um, you know, my, he's my dad's nephew, right? So, cause I'm the youngest one in the family. My dad's the youngest one in his family. So like the age gap between my cousin and I is like massive. So I guess they got to asking about, you know, what's, what's everybody doing, you know? And, oh, how many kids are there? And, and then they got to me. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, yeah, he still lives at home. He doesn't have a real job. He makes these videos on the internet or something. It's just like, oh God, they probably think I'm into porn. <laughs> like, you know, like I like to joke with people. I make videos on the internet. I swear I keep my pants on most of the time. <laughs> you know, they probably think I do something inappropriate now, so it's just great. But, uh, they, they, you know, a lot of the older kind of more traditional people look down on what I do. It's whatever, man, the haters are going to hate. I don't let them bother me. You know, they don't bother me at all. In fact, bring it on. <laughs> I'll prove you wrong <laughs> that this is a viable thing. You know, just saying. <laughs> so it's just kind of funny. It's just kind of funny. And they have kids that are like my age. So I'm surprised they don't kind of understand it from their kids, but I don't think their kids, uh, have anything to do with like the internet life, you know, internet life is where it's at. Just throwing that out there, throwing it out there. The internet years of my life have been better than the years without internet. Yes. Children. I was alive <laughs> before there was internet. Uh, we, I can remember having a, um, we had a family garage sale. So we could afford our first 56K modem, baby. 56 kilobytes. Oh, boy. We were we were top of the line then, boys. We could check email in like five minutes. <laughs> it only took like five minutes to load. <sighs> or something. <laughs> it took forever. It was terrible. All right, guys. There it is. We're done. We're done. How much? Now our harvest income is going to be skewed because of uh, our other numbers. We'll sell the wheat sometime later. We'll hang on to it for now. Uh, when we come back, guys, we will have lots of soybeans. Actually, what's on the field 10? Is that soybeans too? I think it is. Yeah. Oh, but we're going to have a lot of soybeans. We're going to harvest everything in high-speed fashion and then uh, work on, like, the replanting, the, the subsoiling because that needs to be plowed. And I'm going to guess, I'm going to guess it's going to need to be limed. Which, whatever. And then it, when we have money, we will work on smoothing this and taking out all the trees all the way around. Uh, and actually, we don't need money for that. We need need a mod for that in Brux Chipper. We'll take all the trees out all the way around because there's trees down here on the side and then up, uh, up over here. We'll take all the trees out, level this down a little bit on this side, and then plow a pretty good sized field. It's like going to be almost field 11 sitting in here. Saying it's going to be a good size. So, until the high speed video, that'll be the next video in the series. Until then, I'm your boy John from Poopla. Thank you guys for uh, hanging out. If you made it through the bonus time, say banana in the comments. Thanks for everything, guys. Have a great rest of your day, and as always, toodles.